Yeah, well, I'll go on. Coming live again for this New Year's Eve Premier League Grown Up Live Analyst. Yeah. Well, let's start with Manchester United. Manchester United pull off an yet an X victory once again. Hartford victory. 2 1 victory. They dominated the game and deserved to win that game, so. Lots of respect goes out to the Manchester United team. Then we move on to the. Just doing the main games this week, so. We move on to the Chelsea game. It was a one way game, but for a moment in the game, they was very dominating. And Chelsea pull off their victory. Diego Costa scoring yes again, taking back the lead as the top goal scorer in the Premier League. So Chelsea pull off a good victory in that one. So congrats to the Chelsea team and Antonio Conte and that victory. So then we move on to the Liverpool game. If you may not know Liverpool is not my team. Manchester City is my team in the Premier League. Barcelona is my main team overall in any league or any form of the game. But I must support of the Manchester City team. International team is Argentina. So on to the Liverpool game now. Liverpool came through and get the victory was a one goal game the first goal but the only goal of the game was scoring the eight minutes so it was a pretty tactical game wasn't not really flair or no end to end stuff a lot of restrictive play in the game and all that stopping players from, stopping the player from going on back and forth fluently so it wasn't too much of a wasn't too much of a fixture, wasn't too much of an exciting fixture at all at the end of the day. As the game of the day, it wasn't such a big exciting fixture. Well, player of the match, uh, you could say, why not them? Not only for his goal contribution, but for his defensive effort as well, so. He put in quite a effort as the possession in the game City had like 76% of the possession of play which never count for much because they never created much in the entire game at all so they even know what to say about them yeah man so that's it for the Premier League roundup so at the top of the league, Chelsea is 9 point clear again. No, not 9 point clear. 6 point clear of Liverpool. So, Chelsea first extending their unbeaten run at the top of the league. And Liverpool in second place. Manchester City still in third place. Arsenal have a game in and Tottenham has a game in and So let's see how the, them two games, two games come to pan out in the end of the day so Then go back to the transfer yet again Also before we come off that topic Raheem Sterling is very overrated player I think they need to be a major shift in the whole Manchester City team yeah man then over to the transfers as me already told you in an earlier video release earlier in the week that Carlos Tevez is said to be the highest paid footballer in the world well that deal is completed and He's now the highest paid footballer 
in the whole planet collecting a, a hefty sum of 32 million dollars a year 60 pound a second 60 pound a minute rather so you know it already so Carlos Tevez is said to be filthy rich in a couple couple months time or a year or two time so congratulations to him he move over to this Chinese Super League which is proving to be a force to reckon with in terms of flexing financial power so that is it for my video today check you later happy new years when it come to one and all yeah